I switch in, I go slow motion. You feel it? You cannot stop it. It's there. You feel it? You feel it coming. You feel it coming, but you can do nothing. See, it's so, re it's so easy, so relaxed. You cannot stop it. I go under your radar. Of course I can do quick. I'm, I'm very quick. Yeah? If I do speed, but it's also different. You feel that, my speed? It's still very quick. So if, if the people do like this, yeah, you see the people very quick, you see, they can touch, you defend. You see? It's all good, but that's not mastery. If I can do only quick. No, I need to touch. No, both hands. I need to touch, feel. I go slow motion inside, you stop me. You feel that? Feel that, Lena? And then I can do my attacks. I feel you almost coming underneath me. Exactly. I have constant adjustment. I catch your root. Yes. I cut your root off. Yes. I'm not playing with the hands. If you train more the hands, everything, I'm in trouble. I touch, I catch your root. You have no first center line anymore, I have you under control. So I'm focusing on myself. Sionin Tao. People focusing on the techniques, the movement. The choreography, it doesn't mean anything. Yun Kai San have his choreography. Snake Crane Wing Chun have his choreography. <coughs> Yip Man Wing Chun, so many lineages have their choreography. They are all good. It's not about choreography. It's about what's happening inside. The sensations, what do you feel? Can you let go? So instead of doing it, <laughs> you understand? Look my ceiling down, how I practice. People think it's no force. Think it's weak, right? Think what is no force, yeah. <laughs> so weak. <laughs> but this is the power. You feel? And it's, it's also beautiful. It's like flowing. It's like water. See? It's the power is there. And I have my yin punch. I have my yang punch. Yeah? You see, got the fourth set. It's just flowing. So all the power there. There's a different power. It's like a wave. That's what you feel. You make contact, you feel good. Yeah. It bounces. Yeah. You need to manipulate it. As soon as you hold my hand, you manipulate it. And I'm like, very hard on Very hard to make it any So when you do any form, do you... I mean, Letting go. You're, you're I'm melting everything. The whole time is melting. Letting what, go. Are you letting go down? What about up? It's a constant interaction between both. Up, down, yeah. forward, backward. No, what, what? I just, just, just want to get my mind. So what are you letting down yet? I understand that. Yeah. Thinking up, I understand that. How do you do the other one? What's this one? Mm -hmm. In the front of that. Yes. Okay, so where, is, where does the motion start from? Inside. Dante. Yeah, from Dante. That's all motion start from there. Yes. So when you let go from there, and you're, it's not the spine. No. You know what, what the, the problem is for the Western people? Yes. Everything needs to have a structural explanation. So they think internal is about the structure. Spine has to be like that. That has to be like that. No, it's beyond that. It's beyond that. It's happening inside. You read the Quincute of 1840, mm -hmm. written by Yikam, one of the first sentences is, do meridian sink, chi to the dantian. So that is what is happening. That is the engine. It's the first step of the engine. It will take you three years to learn to sink the chi. Specialized exercises. You can never learn it in this seminar. It's impossible. You need to learn the exercises. Then it's three years of training, one hour a day to get that done. That's step one of the internal engine. So people who, who, who talk about internal after seeing some video and after doing something, it's not the same. My question was that when, you let, when, you are, when you're thinking of letting go, do you start from your jantana yeah. or do you start from a particular place? Uh, forget the spine. Not the spine. Paul, can you make uh, all the mats on top of each other? Yeah. 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 
you know when you are grieving in your relationship, are you grieving naturally or are you regretfully about it? Reverse breathing is only necessary to create fudging, shock fudging, to train them. But breathing is chi for a Chinese. But you have another type of chi. It's what they mix up. Breathing is not the same as the other chi. The other chi is something different. But they want everything is a Western explanation. Understand? Because it has to be like that. Because if biomechanically it doesn't fit and stuff, it's not. Structure is the first step for internal. Without good structure, you have nothing. It's the first step. But after the structure, the real internal start is more of the mind with the awareness and the chi. It's different. Would you say that it's, if you could compare it to Mo Li, Mo Jin, that kind of stuff, and, and Shi Sh Sh Li or Shi Li? No, that's each one. But they use the same thing. Chinese martial art, in its essence, is all the same. Bagua, Xing Yi, Tai Chi, uh, each one, it's all the same, like Wing Chun in the old days. The thing is, things got watered down. So many interpretations, right? And not saying others are wrong, it's just different. What I'm teaching is different. But, I mean, I have very good friends in the Wing Chun world, and they're top fighters, and they, everything but they do work so so. And then you can say, oh, long thing, Wing Chun doesn't work, is it? Yeah, you tell that to an Amy Bootstep, but you still take your head off, you understand? Yeah, understand? So, uh, Alan Orr, very good fighter, very good winch. He does things again different. I do things again different. So, you have to just learn, say, hey, this fits me, this works, and that's the reality. I can speak to you three days. Doesn't mean anything, don't listen to me. But if what I teach you helps you a little bit, I'm happy, and then it becomes your reality. I'm just saying, what I teach is the engine from the 1800s. Because I have a different way of thinking with martial arts. I believe in modern day training very much. I also do a lot of sparring for the people that want to know. I am a purple belt BJJ. I like BJJ. I've been doing it since the end of the 80s. Not very intensive, but still, I know my stuff on the ground. I'm a black belt in judo. I like it. But I believe Wing Chun wise, most knowledge can be find, found in the older system. That helps me uh, elevate to another plane. It's just by my belief, it doesn't have to be your belief. What I'm, you're here. I, I want you to show you something. Yeah? Just, just feel when I, I touch you, when I'm in your foot, okay? You brace yourself, okay? Just feel when I'm in your foot. You feel? And then you're gone. But I didn't move my arm. So there's that moment, and that you can do quick. So on touch, then it's gone. You feel that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let you feel. So, and if you see that, if you see that my, my leg. So other people, they need this, yeah? Load up and go. Or they go down, they go down. No, you, look. I'm on my toes, right? I'm on my toes. Yeah. You feel that? Yeah? When I'm going your foot. Two fingers touching you, on my toes. Now you're going. Go. So, is it anything to do with structure going down? You seem to be thinking internally. Internally. That's why it's called internal. <laughs> <laughs> That's why it's called internal. You see all these videos on the forums, they talk about internal, but they do it external. The moment I can see it, it's not internal. Pasta, I finished every topic. Otherwise, we change the, the wording. See, if it was in your mind now, you're doing this thing, you, you, did your mind need to push it? Or? No, I'm just thinking of melting inside, like a candle. I do it outside and inside. I'm melting into him? No, no. I don't care about it. You feel You did a lot of Tai Chi and stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have division also? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you feel that? Eh? I'm here. That's it. Yeah. You feel that? Is the one feet? Is the one with the stick? 
Okay. You, you stand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You stand. So I touch. Now I'm going to I do it very slowly for you. Yeah? Mm -hmm. You feel it, I'm going to melt. And then yeah. in your foot. She's up. Yeah, so when we make contact, now feel, I'm going to melt. You feel? You off your foot, right? <laughs> so you touch me, you, you do your cheese up. Yeah, feel. Now I'm activating the internal. Go on. You go on. Do you see in terms of your connections here, it's a melting? Or you just I just care about myself. Yeah, just and I know, yeah, yeah. I know I can melt more than him, so I have no chance. Yeah, yeah. Do you see my seminars? I never mind to touch hands with nobody. Many people, they teach with the partner, they don't touch with nobody. I touch anybody, because I know my training, I know what I train every day. I never met till now people that bring me into trouble. This effect is because I know my training and I know what the 1800, what the engine can do. Yeah? I have people that come close, but none bring me really into trouble. Understand? But it's not magic. I just train a lot, yeah, a lot. And a few years ago, I didn't train much because I was uh, very sick. So a period, uh, maybe three, four years, didn't train so much. This the period. Where, where's the guy from? Who came to me in Hong Kong? Yeah. Oh, there's another. Oh, me? Yeah. When you came to Hong Kong, yeah. maybe you looked my body, it was different, right? It was the same thing. I was very sick at that time. Right. Okay. Yeah. So I told you when we had dinner that I was not training much. Because I could not. So then the internal skill uh, also uh, goes down. You need to maintain, you need to train. Okay? Is this a, a choice of a way you take? Doesn't mean, again, that other way doesn't uh, work. Yeah? But to give you another example, you know, Hickson Bracing is one of the best in the Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. He's training internal, he's doing yoga, he's doing all kinds of stuff. He excels because he does something internal. If you think you know what is good Jiu Jitsu, <laughs> roll around with Hickson Bracing, and then you know what is really good Jiu Jitsu. There's a difference there, it's a different style. He doesn't do much, but you feel it. Whereas others are very technical, very good, very quick, you can also not stop them. He's different. He moves slow, but it's like a tank. If you ask him, he says, this is breathing method and his yoga, Hatha yoga. So internal gives skill. Would you be able to use that in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu? What you just shown him? Because I, I it, use it. I find it very difficult. To I use it, yeah. If you're relaxed in the jiu-jitsu game, it's already much better. Stiff like a brick, you tap in immediately. Yeah. It's a beautiful game. For me, Wing Chun standing up is like Brazilian jiu-jitsu on the floor. It complements each other so beautifully. Yeah. Yeah. So let, let me continue the seminar, otherwise we're never going to. So take that home, the different kind of pushes. Yeah. Uh, Paul, you come. I, I just show you. I gave you fixed points, later discard it and just touch the whole body, doesn't matter. And then use different kind of energy, very light yielding or very slow yielding. So he, he pushing me, boom, that's it. All kind, this is light now, you see, I'm just yielding wherever he's going to push me, I'm giving away with the force. You see, he feels light, right? Feels light. Yeah. Right. So now he does it more, uh, now I do it more with the sinking, okay, it's more heavy for you. Till you focus more. Huh? Till I can really empty myself. And then you just push in nothing. And I can still stay still. Okay? So take that home with you, this exercise, and work on it. If you want to know what improves this, your sinum tile. Again, doesn't matter which geography, but try to let go. 
try to open up the joints, relax, and let go. The less power you feel, the more power he feels. Power should not be stuck in the body, it should be transferred. If you have a blow, you think, powerful, actually it's not so powerful. The real powerful blow is that you don't feel it, but the other one feels it. We will go later in my punching engine, which is also radically different. Okay, so this is about the body, okay? So I hope I gave you an idea a little bit about what I call snake body. Now let's go to Chisa. And then we integrate my striking in, in the Chisa. So the first step of my Chisa program is divided into two. One is called Toisa. One is called Wasa. This is with striking, this is without striking. Both is needed. For the people that train BJJ, right? You, you cannot randomly do locks. You need position base. When you have the position and the calm, then you can do the lock. It's the same. We need first to have the body under control, to be able to control the center line. Then the striking comes by itself. It's just an add-on. Two things are important in Chisa, in Toisa, okay? Yielding, yielding and sticking. Now, sticking is misunderstood by many. Yeah? Uh, where's the... Uh, Pardon? Oh, yeah. Did you feel, yeah? Can I have a minute? Many think when I have contact, I'm sticking. For me, this is adhering. It's not sticking. Sticking is like the toy you throw in the window and then it crawls down, right? You know that toy? So I have to control all your essence, your center line, when I contact, that's sticking. So you will feel it. This is adhering. And no matter, I can do it very softly, like Lung Ting lineage mostly do. Wong Shun Lung lineage, they use. This kind of force, yeah, impulse. You see Philip Byers back, boom. Very powerful. So most of the Lunting lineage, unfortunately, cannot handle it. And he comes, boom, boom, and they boom, fly, right? But this is again a different engine. Again, not saying it's better, it's different. You feel the difference, and now it's sticking. You feel? Yeah, keeps on coming, right? It's like a wave. But you cannot use it. If I do nothing soft, you can crash it. If I use power, maybe you can push. But this one, you cannot pull. You see? But I already have you. You didn't even notice I have you. It's like a sniper. Huh? You feel it? You're already on the inside. Yeah, you feel it? Touch, do your best. And then I have you. Boom, boom. Bang. <laughs> it's different, right? That's sticking. How I stick? By letting go, emptying myself, taking your center line. Expanding force in I've all directions. I've got nothing to work back from because you're already there. Yes. So this one, muscular pushing, can be used. You can pull. Then you have a push-pull game. Yeah. But when I really know what is sticking, you cannot use it anymore. You don't feel me, okay? And by the way, also this engine uh, takes a little bit longer to cultivate. Yeah, just thinking. But what I want to do now is, Paul, we can demonstrate, and then I, we can do it with all of them. Is we use, try to use the sticking, and try to rock each other's balance, center line. So no hitting yet. So we just, no matter this framework, this is. Yip Man and Yun Kei San, okay? Pun San. Gulo Wing Chun, Snake Brain Wing Chun, use this. Some call it Dab Sao, yeah? Now from here, or from Pun Sao, it doesn't matter, we try to yield, take each other's center of gravity. Yeah? Just take each other's center of gravity. Palm strike on the outside, on the inside, doesn't matter. Yeah? You see how I, how I yield? Stick. Yield. <coughs> He's trying. Do your best. 
trying to get my center. Okay, like that. Make it a game like 10 points. <laughs> Anybody who takes one step loses a point. Okay? No hitting. 